spread out the top to me, bro. Oh my God! I don't know if I want to keep watching this shit. Oh my goodness gracious, man. Shot, bitch. <sighs> Nothing worse than the two teams I hate. I don't even know who I want to favor in this game. By the way, y'all, I do not know if this is the first time ever. But these are one of the first times that I can remember that I do not know the score of this game. I don't know who won this game. I don't know if a nigga choked in this game. I don't know if it was a, a goddamn tie, which I would love to see. Because I would sleep so good tonight if this game was ending in the tie. I, this would be the best sleep since I was a newborn, goddamn, this game was in the tie. But I doubt that shit happened. I got to make sure everything's recording, bro. I can't, I can't possibly fuck this up. Bro, we got the Cowboys and the 49ers a battle between two teams that played in the division around yesterday that... We, you know what I'm saying? We easily make light work of. Bruh, I am so ready for this reaction right here, bruh. This is the... If I had to pick a winner right now, a gun in my head, I would say the 49ers win this game. You know what I'm saying? I think Dallas kind of struggled in, as far as defending the run. They kind of patched things up last week. I know they talked some... They traumatized by Diggs injury and all that bullshit. The excuses is like an ass. Everybody got one. We already know how this shit go, but... Woo, boy. Got the Cowboys and the 49ers, bro. I'm, I'm leaning towards the 49ers just because I like how their run game been going. Uh, um, Purdy has a lost a start that he's that, that that they make up this crazy ass stat again that he started and finished. You know what I'm saying? He hasn't lost a start since then. So, and then the the part of me in my heart wants my Eagles to be the one to beat the 49ers. So I really want the Cowboys to lose this shit. But at the same time. The, the 49 ers been talking so much shit this off season, bro. I really wouldn't mind that they went down right now. Cause the Brandon got Brandon IU. They all talking about niggas in the uh, coming session when I did the Giants video. Niggas talking about some well, Brandon's answering question. Nah, that nigga looking for the question that, that talk about the Eagles. He looking for them bitches. Sometimes I bet them niggas won't even ask him about the Eagles. Like, did you say about something about the Eagles? Oh yeah, let me talk about them motherfuckers. Yeah, them niggas wouldn't lost. They would lost if we had a purge. I don't want to hear that bullshit. Tell your goddamn the genius ass coach you got to goddamn don't block the best one of the best edge rushers with a tight end, man. That's on him. That's not our fault that we got there and doing what we do. You know what I'm saying? We five no for a reason. You know what I'm saying? But enough of that, there, man. Cowboys 49ers. Like I said, I got the 49ers winning this shit. But hey, we'll see, man. We'll see. This be the first time I actually don't troll doing a reaction, man. So I just want to identify both teams. Because if I knew the score, I'd be trolling one of y'all niggas. But so I really don't know the score. I got my phone on airplane mode since this game been on. So I would have no notification. Just turn that bitch on. Flip that bitch over. We fit to figure out what's went down, man. Let me get a thing in 1080 PhD. This is the last time I'm pausing this shit. The rest of that shit, we can let this shit flow on up. I just need to make sure everything's straight. But hey, let's do this, though. Of course he catches the pad. Let me see a little more Eagles see on y'all niggas right quick though. Ah, five and O type shit. This this reaction feels so weird, bro. Go that run game. They go that run game. That's what I was talking. That's what I was worried about for Dallas. They went there that now the first few plays of a game is scripted. So, you know what I'm saying? Like the first 15 plays, you know what I'm saying? They pretty much um, not going deep into their playbook. This is the game, these are the plays they're gonna run regardless of what happened. Y'all know if y'all real football fans, y'all already know this shit. First 15 plays, they script the plays. So that was very easy. We're gonna see how the 49ers offense 
changes after, you know what I'm saying, Dallas didn't got their little data from this first drive, but they went down the field pretty easy on that there. Oh man! Oh, oh, oh man! Oh man! Y'all won't play no ball, bro. Y'all won't play no ball, bro. Debo. Dallas, talk to me, man. Ain't no D. And the word Dallas, man. Talk to me. Ain't no D in the word Dallas, man. Talk to me. 30 15. Let's go. Ooh, okay, okay, okay. Okay. That was cute. Damn, y'all bagged up. If you want to win, puts fucking Pollard in. Oh, no. See, Dallas guarantee. Guarantee! Charles Barkley and bitch, man. Y'all lost this game. You do not turn the ball over against the 49ers that far back. Come on, man. Oh, man. What happened was that he got ran over. Lands right on top of Lewis, so nothing ever hit the ground. So as he was grabbing it out, the ball lands in his lap, and I think that is a pretty clear fumble. You turned the ball over and turned the bitch right back over. Hell no, nah, this is not gonna work. Well, damn, George Kittle coming out party, man. He come, he turned the clock back. George Kittle been used like as a blocker and shit for the four nine. So I ain't really seen too much. You know, he was like one of the between him. It was a part by three, four years ago. It was a battle between Kelsey and Kittle, who was the best tight end in the game. And Kittle and Four Nines fan be telling me Kittle been used more as a blocker since they got Debo and Brandon IU punk ass. Now McCaffrey in the backfield. Now all of a sudden George Kittle then start. You know what I'm saying they unleashing Kittle back there. You still can't forget about him. That's crazy though. He ain't got uh, two touchdowns on the day already. Cooks looking like that safety blanket out here. Gotta get you a Cooks, man. Okay. Hey, Dalton Schultz is better than him, bro. I ain't gonna cap. Dalton Schultz needs to get on my nerves. Got him. <laughs> okay. Okay. Way to respond. Okay. Okay. Gets the Cowboys on the ball. No, he is a disappointed football. I see you. Earlier in this quarter, as Purdy goes to work, and it's caught by a heap at the 40 yard line, and a nice throw for 15. Here's Melissa. Marvin overshone, but he ends up hurt, and everybody had to fill in behind. Screen. Oh, shit. Oh, man. Shout out to Wolf Hunter to stop that. Because that could have been to the crib. Shout out to Wolf Hunter, man. That could have been bad. Wolf Hunter don't get that tackle right there. Man, move this shit out my way. Ain't no D in the word Dallas, man. Especially not no run D. Ooh. That's a tight window he fit, fought, fit, fitted that ball in. That was a tight window. Oh, 
Hey, man. They going up and down the field in their Dallas defense. The Dallas, the, Dallas, the Dallas fan talking about how crazy they destroyed the Patriots. Like, well, we struggled against them niggas, but y'all lost to Arizona. But you see, the Patriots got destroyed today by the second biggest blowout in the Belichick era. Y'all talking about how big the blowout, that was the biggest blowout in the Belichick era. Today, they had the second biggest blowout of the Belichick era. So, you know what I'm saying? Stop comparing, like, what we did to what y'all did. Bro, we, lost, we beat the Colts by one point last year. Y'all blow the Colts out. We played Houston, and we beat them pretty handily. Y'all was fighting for y'all goddamn lives. Like, shit happened, bro. This is the NFL. These are good-ass niggas out here. I hate when y'all be trying to do that comparison and shit. Like, y'all just, you know what I'm saying? When y'all killed the giant, y'all niggas, all on my goddamn uh, video and shit. Bro, it, it, this shit happened, bro. Like, come on. One thing that is consistent with y'all is y'all's not gonna fold on a, a Sunday night. You gotta make it. First year? They ain't want my heart no more. Bro. How good is Brock really? Like, come on. Like, he's really been carving defenses up, bro. Like, damn. He's off and running. Samuel inside the 20. Knocked down at the 18 yard line. And Purdy's actually. Bro, this man is the, the seventh round last pick of the draft. And he just, he been killing niggas, bro. Look at that shit. Damn, man. Purdy, Purdy is balling, bro. Purdy be killing these niggas. But I can't believe, I seriously can't believe how good Purdy is, like, at this point. I know what I'm saying. It's five. This is five games. And then plus the uh, other what? I don't know how many he played last year. Like, ten? Eight to ten last year? I can't believe the, the, the film that he's put out there and people that ain't been able to adjust to him, it makes me think he's for real. Like, I really can't. You can't take nothing away from him. He hasn't been beaten yet. And by the looks of this goddamn skull, ten to, tw to 28, it was like he finna go to five and oh this year. If you want to win, put Pollard in. Shit, right now, Dak got to start throwing some goddamn dots, so. though. Oh, shit. 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 <laughs> oh, man. You can't make this up, bro. They finna get blown out, bro. Man, they got this hyped up ass game. They finna get blown out, bro. Y'all finna get blown out, bro. Cowboys really finna get blown out, bro. Oh my goodness. Oh my fucking god. 35 to 10, bro. This is not what I expected. I ain't gonna cap, bro. I promise you, I did not know what the score of this game was. I really expect this game to be around 21 to 17, 14 to 17 type shit. This nigga didn't drop 35 when y'all hit, bro. All on the defense. None. Oh my God! Damn it! Don't don't talk to me. Don't talk to me. Do not talk to me, bro. Don't come on my video if you're a Cowboys fan today. Don't I see y'all next week. Don't talk to me. Do not talk to me. Especially you ain't got one of them things where you five and no, bro. Don't talk to me. Do not talk to me, bro. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god, bro. Forward, got a big block from 
Fred up the top to me, bro. Oh my God! I don't know if I want to keep watching this shit. Oh my goodness, man! This is crazy as hell, bro. This is crazy as hell, bro. I can't believe this, man. This is not what I expected when I cut this bitch on. I can't believe they getting their ass dismantled the way they is, bro. I can't believe this, bro. The third interception of the night thrown by Prescott, and the former Green Bay Packer comes up with the pick. Bro, don't score no more, bro. Please don't score no more, bro. My heart can't take it, bro. Bro, don't score no more, please, bro. Please don't score another touchdown, bro. Thank you for having mercy on the Cowboys' soul. Shit. I thought the 49ers would play well out here tonight. I didn't think they would beat Noah Stavano. I just did. Man, these niggas went for it on 4th and 7. They getting real disrespectful out here. Especially if Vegas beats Green Bay. Oh, my God. They had Sam Darnold taking that knee, bro. This is just ridiculous. Bro, that was so disappointing to see. That is not what I expected when I cut this video on it. I promise you. I promise to God I am not trolling y'all niggas, bro. I did not know what the score of this game was. Bro, I swear to God, bro. I thought this was going to be like a tough finish and then maybe a Dak choke. This was a Dak choke through four quarters, bro. He's the way he threw three picks, y'all, and he had a, uh, another a fumble. This was just disappointment. But at the end of the day, it's typical Cowboys. Fuck the Commanders. Fuck the Cowboys. And fuck the motherfucking Giants, bro. Don't talk to me today. I don't want to hear nothing from y'all.